Kyle's new V-Skill is Dive Sonic. He jumps forward and shoots a fireball downward. Having it hit or be blocked builds a little V-Meter. You can't cancel into it like a special move. Though you can cancel into it from his target combos. You can't do it while you have a boom on the screen. And you can't cancel it to either trigger. It also doesn't change in either trigger. On hit it's plus 4 at worst, and Guile can link into a light normal and complete a combo. If you connect it from farther away you'll get progressively more plus. You can link it to slower attacks, but obviously you'll be too far for most of your combo friendly normals. On stand block it can be as bad as minus 7, so it's pretty dangerous to do up close. Though again, it becomes dramatically safer if you space it. On crouch block, it seems to be dependent on the opponent's height. On Ryu it seems to be minus 1 at worst, so much safer. Though from close, the opponent can potentially duck under it, which obviously leaves Guile very punishable. It's surprisingly good in neutral if you're spacing it. It allows Guile to approach while keeping both down charge and back charge. The jump is high enough to hop over fireballs. This builds some V-meter, does some damage or chip, and gets Guile closer with an immediate sonic boom charge ready to go. It's quite strong actually. A cancel from the stand short TC seems useless. But the stand strong TC actually does more damage than his other stand strong bread and butter. This is now Guile's optimal 6 frame punish. You can swap this juggled flash kick with EX flash kick or flash kick super if you want to. It also works with his VT2 juggles. Do keep in mind that both variants of this target combo fall out on crouching opponents though. VS2 will also combo after his Crutch Fierce Crush Counter. It's weaker than a Guile High Kick Juggle, but it builds some V-Meter in return. It also technically combos after Towards Fierce Crush Counter. But you'll get more damage out of Dash in Strong. Like all Fireballs, it won't cause any pushback in the corner, so you get some neat combo extensions there. You're also especially close after landing it in the corner, so you can go into his crutch short TC, which doesn't work mid-screen. I personally consider Guile's V-Skill 1 to be one of the best V-Skills in the whole game, since it has significant application in neutral between baiting jumps, winning fireball wars, and allowing safe approaches. VS2 has mildly better combo application, and allows Guile a different kind of safe approach and a different way to win fireball wars, though it's much more proactive and less passive. VS2 is certainly really fun to play around with, and I think it's actually one of the best new V-Skills in Season 5, but whether it's better than Gal's amazing VS1 is a very hard call.